Hello everyone, welcome to the All Outdoor One channel. Today I'm going to do another video on Mora's Oh No. So yeah, I've been using Mora's for several years now and I've never had a Mora fail on me so far. And um, I can be quite abusive with my tools sometimes. And as I said, it hasn't failed on me yet. Uh, this is the one that most people will be familiar with. This is the Mora Clipper, stainless steel version this happens to be. Um, the metal and the, the construction of the blade is awesome on all Mora knives. Um, yeah, maybe the handles and the sheaths aren't fantastic. Uh, this is the one that came with the clipper. I've modded it to carry a fire steel. And um, you can now get an actual proper Mora sheath like this that comes with the fire steel and fire steel holder. Um, yeah, but I've kind of kept my morals on the back shelf for a while now and uh, what made me pull them out again recently is that I recently got one from uh, my girlfriend's um, father um, I did a couple of uh, bits and pieces for him and uh, I suppose as a little reward he got me this this is the uh, carbon steel E. Johnson Mora um, blade length it's uh, slightly longer than the uh, clipper has a super razor edge straight from the factory I mean it's it's ridiculously sh oops that was just user error there it's ridiculously sharp so there we go very little effort required to cut um, yeah the, you know for five pounds, which is roughly what this costs, you really cannot go wrong for that level of sharpness from a five pound knife. Um, high quality carbon steel, not a super thick blade, but could easily bat on with this. Great for woodworking. The handle, although very simple, um, I'm not sure what it's made out of. I think it's elm, um, although I'll add an annotation at the bottom of the screen now if that's not correct. Um, but it fits beautifully in the hand really comfortable to use um, yeah as I said slightly longer blade than the clipper it's uh, from their kind of traditional kind of look range their original knives and honestly you can't go wrong and I think it's a beautiful knife okay the handle might not have the nicest finish the uh, sheath is absolutely horrible in my opinion Sorry, I'll just give you a little uh, close up on this. Yeah, as you can see there, Mora, Sweden. Very light plastic with this pattern on it. Looks cheap, feels cheap, is cheap. But you know, for the price, you really cannot complain. So yeah, it's just kind of uh, reinvigorated my uh, love of Moras. Uh, I've always liked them ever since I first used them. Um, they'll always be a highly reliable and quality blade. Um, I've known many people to actually remove this handle and remove and uh, get rid of this sheath and actually build their own bushcraft knife around it uh, by making a new handle and um, a new sheath for it. Um, but yeah, I just thought I'd uh, put that one out there. Yeah, so that's my um, two cents on uh, Mora's. Um, still a beautiful blade. A joy to use and unbeatable for the price pretty much uh, yeah so you're watching the all out the one channel um, signing out for now take care bye bye